what's up you guys it's your girl Britt and I'm back with another video so today's video as you can see in the title I am going to be unboxing my January boxy charm with you guys and also doing a try on as you can see I already got foundation bronzer blush you know all that good stuff on so with that being said y'all hit that like button also don't forget to get to hit that subscribe button as well and let's get started all right you guys so for those of you who don't know what a boxy charm is it is a monthly subscription beauty box it's 21 dollars, and it comes with i believe five to six full size products um some damn good products like i freaking love boxy charm but that's what it is um if any of you guys are interested in joining this subscription i will leave the link down below that way you guys can get it going so like i said here is what the box looks like let's go ahead and jump on into it so when you first open it um you have this little paper in here and it kind of just gives you a description and price of each product so this month's theme is so cute it's boxy and chill that is fucking cute as hell boxy and chill like i want to like keep this and just like put it on my wall <laughs> so we'll be using this as we go through each okie dokie so the first product we're going to pull out of here is this Dr. Brandt Pores No More Luminizer Primer. It looks like this. It's a pretty big tube. Too bad I can't try it. It's one fluid ounce. Wow. Almost like a foundation type. Let's see how much this costs. Um... I'm really not seeing this on here. One, two, three, four. I'm not seeing this on here, so I'll have to look into this. But so basically, it's just an illuminating primer base. Damn it, I already have on foundation, so I can't try it yet. Okay next <laughs> we'll move on to the next so weird that it's not on there maybe that's just an extra they threw in but who knows okay moving on to the next product we have here i don't know how to pronounce this the briogeo rosarco milk it is like a leave-in condition spray um i'm down to try it let's see i'm just spraying it like on the top Mm, it smells good and this retails for $12 so that's not bad um, I will definitely be using this because I love to use different products for my hair also you guys your girl is getting her hair done tomorrow I'm not gonna tell you guys how it's gonna look but you guys will see it's probably gonna be ugly on me but oh well all right, so next product we got up in here is the Billion Dollar Brows Universal Brow Pencil. It's not like an actual pencil. It, you know, comes up. And then on the end, you have your little spoolie. And this retails for $18. I do have a little bit of product on my brows, but, I mean, let's see how it looks on my hand. Let's just go like this. Okay. It seems pretty creamy, pretty easy. I might actually use this. And I normally don't use pencils. I use pomades, so I might use this. We'll see. We'll see. Okay, moving on to the next product. All right, we have the Ofra Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick in the color Miami Fever. We're okay, gonna we're going to try this on. I normally, I never really used colors like this, but, oh my gosh, it smells so good, dude. Who, oh, I can see my nose. Who doesn't love a liquid lip that smells super good? Okay, the color is not as bad as I thought. It is very pigmented. I just got this whole bottom lip with one swipe. 
Can we get the top? Let's see. Come on, Ofra. Mmm, it's super creamy. I like it. I actually like this color. Like, it's really not bad. And it's super pigmented. Like, I got this whole lip with one swipe. I don't think I told y'all how much that um, lip stuff retailed for. That retailed for 20 bucks. The Ofra lipstick. Next product. We got a palette. As you can see, it is the Tarte. Rainforest of the Sea Volume 3. Love the packaging. It is so cute. Let's see how it looks. Here is the palette, you guys. I love Tarte's packaging. Like, they've got the most cutest ever. Like, okay. And here are the shades in here. Look at my little picture that's on my wall, you guys. <laughs> but these are the shades. Let's let's do something. They're very neutral colors, so we can create something nice and simple with this. So, um, let's see how much this retails for. $36. Let's try it. Let's see. Yeah. All right, you guys. So, there's only literally one matte shade in here, and it is this one right here. I feel like you can kind of use these for your eyes or, like, as a highlighter, too. So, let's just start with that. Um, matte shade. It is called Tiki. I'm just going to use the mirror it comes with. What y'all doing, boys? Let me look. So, Let like, if you're someone who likes a really natural look, I think you will really enjoy this palette. I mean, I'm kind of both ways. Like, I love dramatic, and then I also love a natural, you know, cute look as well. Okay, so we got that on. This is kind of tough. I think I'm going to try to jump into this color and just kind of darken it up the best I can. Alright, let's put on this shade right here. It's called Malibu, just to kind of darken it up. Kind of want to, you know, I don't want it just straight shimmer on my eye. But yeah, this is a really cute, fun palette. I'll probably mm, use it as, like, highlighter for real. Doesn't have any fallout. Well, at least that I can see. Yeah, it's not too bad, you guys. It's, like, a very subtle, you know, look. We're going to just hop on to a shimmer and place it on the um, a lid and see how that turns out. What do I want to use? I think I'm going to try this one right here. It's called Compass. Alright, so I'm not going to wet the brush yet. I'm going to see how it does without uh, wetting the brush. And if I feel like I need more. Oh no, girl. She's going. She's going. I could definitely do like a look like this for work, you know, something like that, but it's really cute. Like I said, very, very subtle. Got some on the back. I think I'm going to put another one on top of this one because, like, I kind of want to try <laughs> as much as I can because we really don't look like we got much going on. So, for fun, let's jump into this one. It is called Treasure. Let's put some of this on. Alright, let's put this treasure on our eye. Ooh, she's pretty. Yeah, like, you can definitely just use, like, this as, like, crease shades, like, for this palette. Like, it can be specifically for your creases after you, like, put on your mattes or whatever colors. You can top it off with any of these shades in here. Because they do go on really nicely. 
So yeah, it's not too bad, you guys. I think now we're gonna test one out as a highlighter. So where's my highlighter brush? I think I'm going to use this one right here again as a highlighter, the compass color, and just see how it does. Ooh, 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 girl, I just used it as a highlight, and it is, like, super, super cute. Like, look at my nose. So, I mean, like I said, it's a very, like, natural you know type of palette i like it it's cute like i said i'll probably usually i usually i'll probably mainly use it as like a highlighter or you know just for the like a shimmer color let's move on to the next thing all right so these are the last things in the box it is the tatcha um, luminous dewy skin mask and these retail for 24 dollars I love face masks, so I will definitely use these. Let's see what this is supposed to do. So it's for normal to dry skin. So it's a dewy skin mask. All right. And I love Tatcha. I don't have nothing by them, but like I, I will soon one day have all of the brands that I've ever wanted. Like I want to have a collection of like certain brands you know and like have like all of their stuff on one side and then have the other brands that I want on the other side of my desk so like I don't know I'm crazy you guys if y'all see my desk right now y'all would be like what is she doing because like I have like literally every single eyeshadow palette out on my desk right now but yeah anyways you guys so this is what I got in my January boxy charm. I'm going to set this face now. I'm going to be using this Broadway color setting spray. I got it from the dollar store, but I'm not even gonna lie, I like it. It smells really good and it sets it pretty good. So, not complaining to be two dollars. But, anyways, you guys, that's what I've got for today's video. Um, let me know if you guys like me doing, you know, the unboxing of my boxy charms. Like, let me know how you feel. Also, like I said, I'll leave um, the link down below. So if any of you guys want to try boxy charm out, it's really worth it. Guarantee you, you will be happy as hell. Like me. So, and also, don't forget, your girl got this giveaway going on. It started on, it started yesterday, I believe the 12th or the 11th, and it's going to end on the 25th. So, any new people, y'all go check out the giveaway video that I have, and rules are in the description. So, that's it. I love you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and we will see you on the next one. Bye, loves. Mm -hmm.